I'm sure that wasn't Beth. cheap to buy that ad. That's huge. Yeah. You can see, guys, a lot of people are troubled with what the party is doing. They changed the rules to benefit one guy, <laughs> and yeah. many people are saying that it's unfair to the other candidates that are already out of the race. And the problem for the Democrats then, as you know, Lawrence, because you've been to those rallies, they yep. love Bernie so much. If he's not on the ticket and they feel that the DNC ripped him off, they're just not going to show up to vote for anybody in November. No, they've, and, and if you're one of these campaigns that spent a lot of time raising small dollar uh, donations so that you can reach the threshold to get into the debate right. and then they erase it, there's a reason for a lot of that frustration. One of the camps that did just that was, uh, was Pete Buttigieg. He's been on the stage. He'll be on the stage tonight. Yeah. Well, he was doing, he did a town hall in Las Vegas, as did many other candidates on CNN. He was asked a question by Aaron Burnett. Uh, the question reveals as much as the answer. We're going to play it and then get your response, Lawrence. Watch. You think it's impossible... <laughs> To be a Christian and a Trump supporter was her question. Look, I'm not going to get into theology because we'll be here all day. I'm a preacher's kid, so I I'm not going to go back and forth on it. But I think the question set up says a lot about CNN. Exactly. And also, I, I think uh, Pete needs to worry about the conservatives that are now going to be in that primary. It's Democrats, Republicans. The Bible's there so that it can try to keep us in check. It's a guideline for us to live our lives. It doesn't mean we follow every single thing in the Bible. We try to, but we're failures. Yeah, and I don't think the government paying for everything is quite a, a, a Christian doctrine. I also don't think killing kids is Christian do doctrine as well. But again, like I said, I can go back and forth with Mayor Pete on that all day about their value system with the left. And I think they become even more progressive getting away from those Christian values. Again, the Democratic Party used to value th that e evangelical vote. And right now they shun those people. He needs to be worried about how he's going to get those voters because right now we're not seeing a lot of Christian voters out there supporting Mayor Pete. All right, uh, joining us from the so-called Sin City of Las Vegas. <laughs> no. It all comes all right. together. Don't Lawrence, get thank in you any trouble, Lawrence. They hate that. They hate no, that. No, I know <laughs> they do. I know. <laughs>